examples are there is no presence of absence first example where the curve y square into a square minus x square equal to x lies in the interval and what are the options option a is x greater than a b is 0 less than x less than a or x between 0 to a option c option c x between minus a to 0 and option b 0 less than x less than a and x less than minus a so what we will do we will check what happens when x is greater than a so for x greater than a for example suppose if i take x is equal to 3a upon 2 then what is y square y square from the given equation of curve y square is x upon a square minus x square put x as a 3a by 2 so it is 3a by 2 divided by a square minus 9a square upon 4 so that is 3a by 2 and denominator is minus 5a square upon 4 so that will be 3a upon 2 into minus 4 upon 5a square this is 2 plus of 4 1 a cancels so what remains 6 divided by 5a and this minus sign so what we have y square is negative less than 0 for x greater than a so as y square is negative it implies y is imaginary and as y is imaginary means curve does not exist question is about the existence so for x greater than a curve will not exist option a is wrong similarly let us check the let us check the option b for option b what we have x is between x is between 0 to a suppose for example if i take the value of x as a upon 2 then what will have y square will be equal to x divided by a square minus x square that is a upon 2 and a square minus x square is that is a square minus x square is a square upon 4 so what will have a upon 2 divided by 3a square upon 4 that is a upon 2 into 4 upon 3a square so 2 plus a so what remains 2a a will also cancel so what remains only 2 upon 3a which is positive so y square positive it means y exists y square positive it means y exists so there is existence in this interval between 0 and a x between 0 and a now we will check option c option c what is option c for x between minus a to 0 for example you can have x as a minus a upon 2 between minus a and 0 so with this x as a minus a upon 2 y square will be equal to minus a upon 2 divided by a square minus okay let us write it as a x upon a square minus x square y square formula that is minus a upon 2 divided by a square minus a square upon 4 so it is minus a upon 2 this is 3 a square upon 4 that is minus a upon 2 into 2 upon 3 a square it is it cancel a also cancel what remains minus 1 upon 3a you can see y square negative so it means y is imaginary y does not exist with this answer option c is wrong so if you compare option b and option c there is a common part 0 less than x less than a so we cannot conclude that only option b is correct we have to check option b also in option b we have to check what happens with x less than minus a for x less than minus a so for example let us consider x as a minus 3a upon 2 so for this y square will be equal to x upon a square minus x square that is minus 3a upon 2 divided by a square minus 
माइन ए स्क्वायर अपॉन फोर दैट इज माइनस थ्री ए अपॉन टू इन टू दिस विल बी दिस विल बी माइनस फाइव ए स्क्वायर अपॉन फोर विच विल गेट इन्वर्टेड मीन्स इट इज माइनस फोर अपॉन फाइव ए स्क्वायर एंड यू कैन सी दैट इफ यू इवेल्यूएट दिस दिस माइनस वन विल बिकम प्लस एंड आफ्टर सिंप्लीफाइंग द फाइनल वैल्यू विल बी पॉजिटिव मीन्स वाई स्क्वायर इज पॉजिटिव मीन्स वाई एग्जिस्ट वाई एग्जिस्ट सो मोर करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी फॉर एक्स लेस दैन माइनस एल सो कर एग्जिस्ट एंड बिटवीन जीरो टू एल सो कर एग्जिस्ट नॉट ओनली दिस फॉर एक्स एल लेस दैन माइनस एल सो सो आंसर फॉर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इट इज ऑप्शन डी ओके फॉर क्वेश्चन नंबर टू क्वेश्चन नंबर टू इज द रीजन ऑफ ऑप्शन फॉर द कर रिप्रेजेंटेड बाय x y square is equal to a square into a minus x. So it is easy to write that y square in terms of x. So y square we can write a square into a minus x divided by x. And the question is about the absence where the curve is absent. Curve does not exist. So what are the options? Option A is x greater than zero. Let us check option A. X greater than zero and x less than A. These are the two things. Suppose if we take x is equal to a upon two, x is equal to a upon two. So both the things will be that is by x is equal to a upon two is greater than zero and also less than a. So we can write y square for this. So y square is equal to a square into a minus x divided by x. That is a square into a minus x we are considering a by 2 divided by x is a by 2 so what it is a square it is a square into a by 2 means it is a cube upon 2 divided by a upon 2 that is a cube upon 2 into 2 upon a so finally it will be A square, it will cancel. Just A square. So y square is equal to A square, and y A square positive. So y will exist. But we need options. So here the curve is present. So option A is wrong. Option A is wrong. Why it is in the options of the curve? So option A is wrong. So let us check option B. Now, what is option B? X less than zero and x less than a. X less than zero and x less than a. So you can see that x less than a. X less than a. In the option A itself, we have checked if for x equal to a by two, and this a by two is less than a. And for this curve is existing, so it means B is also wrong. Means B is also wrong. Curve exists for this x less than a. So option B we cannot see the answer. Option C, what is option C? X less than zero and x greater than a. For x less than zero means negative value have to consider. So if I consider x is equal to minus a by two, what will I have? Y square is equal to this a square as it is. A minus a by two, so a minus minus because x we are considering. As a minus a by two, less than zero. So a minus minus means this will be a plus a by two means three a by two, and denominator will be minus a by two. So you can see that this is a negative value. Y square is negative. Y square is negative. Therefore, y will be imaginary. Means y does not exist. So for x less than zero. Y does not exist. Means curve is absent. Let us check for x greater than a. For x greater than a, for example, suppose we take the value x is equal to three a upon two. So y square will be equal to what? A square into a minus three a upon two. So a minus three a upon two will be minus a by two divided by x that is three a by two. Again, you can see that this value is negative. So y square is less than zero negative. 
i square is less than 0 negative it means ball is imaginary because square root of negative is imaginary it means y does not y does not exist so for s greater than a also y does not exist means curve does not exist means for both is x less than 0 and x greater than a curve is not existing means it is the option so option c is the correct answer so for second question answer is option c now let us move for question number three question number three what is question number three the region of options for the curve region of options for the curve a square x square is equal to y cube into 2a minus y now here it is easy to write x square in the form of y so x square is equal to y cube into 2a minus y divided by divided by a square the question is about the options for which value the curve is option okay let us check option A. Option A is x less than 0 and y less than 2a. There is no question of considering x. Restriction is on y. We have to consider y means here itself we can we can uh, you can say that the option A is wrong because there is no condition on x. We have to check for which values of y x does not exist. For which values of y x does not exist. So option A we cannot check, we don't have to check. Let us check option B. Option B is y less than 0 and y greater than 2a. So for y less than 0 consider y as a minus a by 2. If I consider y as minus a by 2, what is x square? Now we will write down directly plus or minus, positive or negative. If I take y as minus a by 2, it will be 2a minus minus plus. Means this thing negatively positive, this will be positive. 2a minus minus means plus a by 2, that is positive. y cube, this will be negative. This will be negative. This term is positive, this is negative. So eventually numerator will be negative. And denominator will be positive. But positive upon negative upon positive is negative. It implies x square is negative. That is x is imaginary means x does not exist. So for y equal to minus a by 2 means for y for y less than 0 curve does not exist. Now for y less than 2a for y less than 2a so less than 2a suppose we take the value of y as 3a upon 2 less than 2a so what you can say about x square will it be positive or negative for y equal to 3a by 2 it will be okay in the option oh, so we have taken it wrongly we have to consider y greater than 2a y greater than 2a is option b so for greater than 2a let us consider y as a 5 upon 2 now for this y as a phi upon 2 what is x square this will be positive for phi upon 2 but this thing 2a minus phi upon 2 will be negative so the numerator will be negative denominator will be positive but finally the term will be negative so x square negative it implies x is imaginary it means x does not exist x does not exist therefore option b for both y less than 0 and y greater than 2a curve is absent so option b is the correct answer so for third question answer is option b okay. now let us go for question number four question number four is The region of options for the curve y square into 4 minus x is equal to x into x minus 2 bracket square. 
and from this we can write y square in the form of x y square is equal to x into x minus 2 bracket square divided by 4 minus x and the question is about the options okay now what is option a option a is x greater than 0 and x greater than 2 for x greater than 0 let us consider x as a minus 1 here there is no a means we can take the particular values so if i take x as a minus 1 what is y square y square will be it is negative minus 1 minus 2 that is positive so numerator is negative and denominator 4 minus minus means positive so the answer will be negative okay if we take x as a minus 1 this thing will be minus but square is positive and this x is negative so the term will be negative and denominator is positive so eventually the term will be y square will be negative so y is imaginary so y does not exist y does not exist for x greater than 2 so let us take x as a 3 x as a 3 so what do you have y square will be equal to this will be positive this will be also positive and denominator will be also positive means y square is positive it means y exists so we are getting the two different things for this x less than 0 curve does not exist but for x greater than 2 curve curve exists for x less than 0 curve does not exist so option a we cannot Conclude about the option because it is a mixture. For x less than 0, there is existence. For x greater than 2, there is a absence. Let us go for option B. Option B is x, x less than 2 and x greater than 4. x less than 2 and x greater than 4 so for x less than 2 let us consider x as a 1 so y square will be 1 for x1 it will be 1 minus 2 but square is positive means this is positive this is positive and denominator is also positive denominator is also positive so y square will be positive that means y exist so curve exist but we are entering the absence here there is a presence so option B is also wrong. A is wrong. B is wrong. Now let us check option C. What is option C? X greater than 0 and X less than 4. X greater than 0. So let us consider X equal to 1. And in the previous discussion, we have taken X as a 1. And for X equal to 1, there is a presence. There is a presence y square is existing therefore c is also wrong we are interested in the options now consider the last option now in the exam you can directly pick b option because first three options are wrong so you can directly pick option b no need to check so the question number four answer is option d next question number it is about the parametric curve the region of presence for the curve presented by the equation x is equal to a into t plus sin t and y is equal to a into 1 plus cos t so for parametric curve here you can have that trigonometry and cos we know it lies between minus 1 to plus 1 so cos lies between minus 1 to plus 1 means highest value of cos is plus 1 and lowest value is minus 1 so for cos t equal to 1 what you can say about y cos t is equal to 1 y is y is a into 1 plus 1 that is that is 2a and for cos t is equal to minus 1 y is equal to a into 1 minus 1 means 0 it means you can see that y is maximum 2a and minimum 0 so this is the limitation or you can say the for this value of y curve is existing or there is a presence of curve so 
zero less than y less than two a that is zero less than equal to y less than equal to two a is so option a. So for question number five, answer is option a. Okay, let us consider question number six. The region of presence for the curve. Again, you have the parametric curve. X is equal to a. Cos cube t, y is equal to a. Sin cube of t. Now here, both the trigonometry we have, and cos and sin we know both are lying between minus one to plus one. So that will give you that x x will lie between minus a to plus a because maximum cos will be plus one. So x will be maximum a and a minimum uh, cos will be minus one. So x will be minimum minus a. So x between minus a to plus a. Similarly, y lies between minus a to plus a. So this is the limitation for the given parametric curve. x between minus a to plus a and y between minus a to plus a so answer for question 6 is option d now let us consider last example seven the region of presence for the curve represented by x equal to t square and y equal to t minus t cube upon 3 now again with the parametric but it is not contained in the trigonometry here you can see that If I take x negative, then that will imply t square will be negative. That implies t is imaginary. T will not exist. So it means for x less than zero, there is a problem for t. It means curve does not exist for x less than zero. Curve does not exist for x less than zero. So the region of presence for the curve is strictly Region of presence is strictly region of presence is strictly x greater than or equal to zero. So option A is the correct answer for seven. Answer is option A. If if the question is absence, then the answer will be x less than zero. If they asked presence, so for presence you have to consider x greater than zero. This is about the. Is there no presence and absence?